guys. Just want to update you on what's been going on at Lighted Path Ranch this month. And as always, the Lord's been good to us. He sent us a few different people our way to lift our spirits and to help us build the camp. And one was Hank from Connecticut. Hank I met with Samaritan's Purse briefly in uh, South Carolina when I was working there with them. And he, he's he been following us and he wanted to come help us. So he he drove like 16 and a half hours to to come help us and he was a he was a great help he he was family because he's a brother in christ he came and helped us work on several different projects that a lot of a lot of posts and a lot of concrete we we handled over seven thousand around seven thousand pounds of sacrete bags of sacrete on these hillsides putting in posts for the uh, bagot cabin foundation posts for the bagot cabin and foundation posts for the, the gowdy cabin and we also put in a lot of posts for two two different solar arrays. And we also did a little bit of work on the sawmill shed. And these stairs behind us, these stairs lead down into, I'm sitting in the storm shelter right now. And these stairs make it a lot easier than an extension ladder so when volunteers are here, they can get down in here safe. And then we had Bruce and Sharla, our Alaskan friends that we met through Samaritan's Purse volunteering and have known for years now and, and their their family as well they came they came and just lifted our spirits and it was it was a good 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 time with them as well and the lord just used these three different people to remind me of something and it just and there's a there's scripture I used scripture this morning to remind that reminded me of these three people and that that scripture was on um, when paul was talking to the church in corinth he said in first corinthians 1558 therefore my beloved brother be steadfast and immovable always abounding in the work of the lord knowing that your labor is not in vain in the lord and that just reminds me a lot of them bruce and charla no matter where the lord sends them they're always willing to go no matter what state it is and now alaska and and they know that none of the works ever been in vain that the lord the lord has a purpose for it and and, and they just they just serve in, in blind faith and they, they've always inspired me. Then Hank, my brother Hank, he's retired. Instead of just sit, sitting and soaking and souring, he decided he wanted to use his retirement to get out and, and to help him. And I'm glad he chose to come help us because he, he was a great help to us. We just want to thank you guys for your support, your love, and your prayers. And just please continue to pray for us. And, and as Eli always says, I love you, and I'll see you next time.